have led to the shooting. Peace through a block party. Organizers today for Heal the Hood event, they held a mini festival that they hope can help bring unity to a neighborhood on Milwaukee's north side. They told our A.J. Byatt for the party is just beginning. Three, peace. Peace is the theme for Sunday's festivities. The goal is to see a brighter future for the youth, seriously. I think a lot of the times we, we talk about the disparities that we face in the community, but uh, a lot of times we don't do nothing about the disparities that we face in our communities. Ajamu Butler launched Heal the Hood last year. He brought it back this Memorial Day weekend, but moved the venue to a new location. It's one of the most impoverished communities over here, one of the most crime-ridden communities. Nathan Ring, make some noise right now. Just 12 hours before the event kicked off, Police responded to a shooting less than a mile from 9th and Ring. Two people were wounded. And the fact that something happened a few blocks away from here just makes events like this even that much more significant. And we're trying to reach people that may not ordinarily get reached. Alderwoman Malele Cog says one of the main reasons for having the event is to get neighbors together. Beyond the block party, she says groups are working to beautify vacant land and rehab abandoned houses in crime ridden neighborhoods. Hill the Hood is not just a block party, it's a movement. AJ Bayapur, Fox 6 News. While Heal the Hood is a year-round program, a similar event to the block party is scheduled for June 29th. Several groups are hosting a Voices Against Violence rally, which will be at the Martin Luther King Jr. Center. Well, tomorrow, and that's just about 55 minutes.